Almost overnight, our world has changed. Its devastating blow felt throughout our profession. How do I take care of my employees? What happens to them? Would I be able to practice dentistry the way I've been able to take care of patients? Would I be able to see my patients and treat them the same way? In the face of unprecedented clinical and economic challenges, our ADA community rallied. The ADA developed clear and concise guidance for the dental community to present the return to work guide. I do think the, the rapidity at which some of these rapid reviews are getting out there should help inform um, future evolving recommendations. What the ADA did that was most helpful during the pandemic involved the power of three webinars, always keeping us up to date. With resources, guidance, science, and unwavering support. The number of resources that the ADA has provided that have helped me feel unstuck in the last three months, I can't even begin to tell you the gratitude that I feel knowing that I have you all in my corner. Leading the dental profession forward. And together, we found strength, resilience, our way back. Thank you to the American Dental Association for sending us a shipment of KN95 masks from FEMA. You've given me certainty in uncertain times by showing me how to keep my patients, my team members, and myself safe. That peace of mind is priceless. The pandemic was something that no one could have predicted, but the ADA did their part by informing their members with every step that they were taking. If we didn't have this group lobbying for us, ensuring that there was somebody at the table looking out for dentists, looking out for their dental team members, looking out for our patients, I don't know where we, we would be in this day. So I was very, very thankful for the ADA and their resources. There's still a lot of work to do, but no matter what's ahead, we'll be there with you. Stick with it, we're gonna be okay. We're in this thing together. Stay unified and we'll fight to win the battle. We've got your back, always.